Maxi! Oh, look at her! Oh, look at my girl! Look at my... Look at my healthy girl! You know, the last time I saw you... I feel a lot better now. Oh, really? Well, you... You... You look a lot better, too. Oh, thank you. Not, not that you... Not that you're not the most beautiful girl in the world, but... I know. After Mommy. Oh, no, no. Mommy's the most beautiful woman in the world. You're the most beautiful girl in the world. Hey, guess what? I got something for you. Want to see it? A present? What, what do you mean, a present? Of course, a present. I travel the world far and wide just to bring you the most outrageous gifts I can find. Sit down. <clears throat> Maximilian, may I introduce... This is Sir Ralph Yeoman of the Guard. Sir Ralph, I would like to introduce you to Maxie. This is whom you shall guard with your life. <coughs> oh, 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 what a lovely girl. Oh, Frisco, what an assignment this one is. <coughs> Might I have a little hug? Yes, you may. Come here. I love them, Daddy. You do? Oh, good, good. Sir Ralph, you will sit on my bedside table and guard me while I sleep. Now, listen, he's just not another pretty face, you know. He's also available to crack walnuts at Thanksgiving with his mouth. See? Daddy? Yeah? Will you be here to show me? At Thanksgiving, I mean? Well, Mommy and I were just discussing that. Hmm? Oh, boy. You will be here in the morning, won't you? They couldn't tear me away. So, if I go back to bed now... Yes? We can still have breakfast together? Cross my heart. <laughs> Great. Okay. Come on, Sir Ralph. Let me introduce you to your new friend. W would you like me to help? Yes, please. Oh, come on, mates. Let's go. Sir Ralph, let me give you a grand tour of the entire household. Oh, say good night, Mom. Bye-bye, Mom. Good See you night. later. Okay, Sir Ralph, let's get the first... Stretched out on the bed with her and uh, fall asleep. Almost. That's amazing to see her like that, all, all full of life and energy. It's the miracle, all right. Yeah, I'll tell you, the real miracle is the fact that I might have had anything to do with that amazing little person. Man, it do give life a sense of purpose. Do it. Hmm. How long have you been awake? Hmm. I don't know, almost a couple days. <clears throat> the flight from London was late getting into New York, and we missed the connection to poor Charles, so we had to, uh, we had to wait. We? Really? Yeah. Rakeem came with me. Who oh, is he? He's at the Port Charles Hotel. Oh, that's wonderful. I'd really like to see him again. That means you're still working, and that you'll be leaving again soon? No, it doesn't mean that at all. Well, then why is Rakeem with you? Well, because he wanted to see you. And he wanted to see Tony, and he wanted to meet the girls. And he also wanted to see poor Charles. You know, he's heard so much about this place, he asked me if he could come along and see it with his own eyes. Let's see. So, can we go back to the question? Which was? You want me to stay? 